Hey guys, how you doing? This is David Anthony Carter. And I hope you're having a blessed day today. And I want to actually talk to you about, in spite of fear, you can do anything in life. You know, whatever you want to accomplish, whatever you want to achieve, you can do whatever you want. Because when you want to do what, if your mind is your mind is so powerful that you could achieve whatever your goals are, whatever your dreams are, whatever your desire are, whatever your vision is, because whenever you come to a situation it's always about fear so you know when you have when you walking on the bridge or you know when you walking over a bridge and you have water underneath of you and you so so high up in the air and you walking across from one side to another you know sometimes people ordinary have fear of crossing the other side because they don't know whether the bridge is going to give out are, is it stable enough for me to walk across? Is it safe? You know, it's so much fear and so much preparation inside where they automatically say, well, I don't want to walk across. I'm going to just stay right over here. But in other times, you know, you have the the 2% that would just say, hey, bump it. I'm going to just go across and see what's on the other side because I know it's gold on the other side or I know it's more wisdom on the other side. So, you know, in spite of fear, you can do anything you want to do in life. Once you put your mind to it and apply the knowledge and make it happen for yourself, you could do it. I don't care who who you are and what's your situation. You could be retarded. You could be mentally. You could uh, be blind. You could be deaf. I don't care. If your mind could conceive it and visualize it in your mind, you can do whatever you want in life and don't let nobody ever tell you that you can't do it because I believe in you and I know you can. And despite the fear, you can do whatever you want to do in life. And with that being said, make sure you visit www.secedewithusnow.com. That's www.secedewithusnow.com. And I want you to be successful. I want you to succeed with us and you know, take yourself and take your knowledge to a newer level. And, you know, you get in the inner circle and you start listening to different audios and preparing your mind for excelling to better and endeavor newer things in life. I mean, it just, it's just about how you condition your mind. It's almost like football, boxing, basketball, baseball tennis, any type of sport, you have to condition your mind first to even play it. Thoughts have to come to your mind before you even get on the court and shoot that basketball or get on the court and swing at that tennis ball or get on that field and play baseball and swing at the ball. I mean, it's so much stuff that you have to condition yourself with and knowing that you can achieve whatever you want in life. Even hockey, you got to get on the ice. So you got to go make it happen. So the thoughts got to come in your head first that you want to get on the ice and, you know, hit the puck with the hockey stick. So it's so much things that's in life where, you know, it's abundance of opportunities. And, you know, that's the beautiful thing about this world is so much abundance. It's so much prosperity. You just have to look around and recognize it for yourself. I mean, it's a great feeling. It's just, sometimes I just can't even explain it. You just have to look at it in a different eye. You have to kind of feel your way out. You know, sometimes I love the birds chirping. Some, sometimes I love when the wind blow. And why I say sometimes is because of the simple fact I don't always see that stuff progression in life because I'm moving around I'm doing things like today I spent time with my nephew and my little brother out at the basketball court I didn't I didn't pay attention to the wind I didn't pay attention to the birds chirping that's why I say sometimes because you know when you focus on doing something like I was focusing on playing basketball that's all I was focusing on and just spending time with them showing them the skills and showing them the right way of how to conduct themselves when playing basketball, just showing them that they could do whatever they want to do. Even if you want to be a, be a basketball 
a star or, or play basketball. It got to be conceived in your mind first that you can achieve it. And once that's done, once that first process is done, you will start reaping with your soul. I mean, it's in the Bible. I mean, that's something else I do every day now. I read the Bible daily every single morning. It doesn't matter whether I wake up at 4 a.m. or whether I wake up at 11.50 a.m. I read the Bible every morning. I don't care whether I'm on the way to my job or whether, you know, I'm running a little late. I still read every morning the Bible. I still read the daily bread. I still read the daily teachings. I mean... It's important that you read to enhance your life. Enhance your vocabulary is very important. I didn't even mean for this video to go on for so long, but I just want to share the intense value. Despite of fear, you can conquer anything in life. And with that being said, I want you to have a blessing, awesome day, an audacious day, a marvelous day today. And make sure you excel in life. And despite a fear. See ya.